morning, I suppose. Weird night. Okay, time for breakfast. What have I got to do today? I can't actually remember. Oh. Wrong part of my pack there. That looks good. Alright. Now, let's see. Um... We've dealt with Alamu Nethri. Damnable tavern! Damnable owner! How dare he allow that lizard to engage in such a salacious display! S scandalous! Is he an Altmer? I have a feeling he's an Altmer. Altmer. I have to be careful with that since I actually know who the Aldmer were. Which is to say the, um... Oh, that's right! I need to go what grab some potions. And, uh... And she's not there. Of course. Okay, well... Time to figure out what else to do for the day besides that. That stained glass has done so well. I had that figured for a lost art, but... You know. I suppose you, uh, you don't lose an art if a, if a, um... Oh. Heard there were ogres around. Be careful, Trevor. Oh yes, I know. I actually want to go see... Speaking of architecture, I want to go see the, um... The castle, because I have not seen that yet. And I figure, you know, I'm in Bruma, I might as well. Ah, uh, well, these walls are quite impenetrable looking. There's, I think, Carvain. And here is Castle Bruma. With the stables of whatever outside. Beautiful. We didn't really have much of a castle in, uh... In Coral. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry to bother. I don't suppose you've seen any priceless Sakaviri heirlooms gallivanting around Bruma, have you? Well, um... Sorry, what are you talking about? Sakaviri heirlooms. Priceless Sakaviri heirlooms. Seen any? Uh, no, uh... No heirlooms. As I suspected, sorry to bother you, citizen. No, it's, it's alright. Just, uh, let me know if any do crop up, yeah? Thanks. Sure. Um, uh, wh what's all this about, might I ask? A whole lot of uproar about nothing, that's what. The Count's been nagging my life and soul out about the damn things. You see, the Carvanes have a sort of family tradition. They've acquired a taste for Akaviri artifacts, constantly collecting more and more. Been going on for centuries now. Well, it turns out poor old Count Desilus... <coughs> Count Carvain? Isn't too happy that his collection's been stolen. Um... You, uh... Don't get along well with the Count, do you? No, not tensions as such, just... I'm tired. I've had four sleepless nights in a row. The Count's talking my ear off about these artifacts and it's stopping me from tending to more important issues. Uh, not that I'm disloyal to Count Carvain, of course. I've never had reason to dislike our ruler. Better him than some of the other Counts and Countesses in the province. Uh, uh well, let me get out of your people's way, uh, and good luck with that. Thanks. Divines know I need it. Right. Sorry, yeah, I'm in the walls. We'll keep you safe. Mine. Outside, oh. watch your own back. We clear them out, they always come back. Well, that was interesting. Um. Hmm. You know, I know what sleepless nights are like. Sir? Let's go find him. Us guards. Excuse me, how do you. Uh, we miss nothing. I'm, I'm sure you don't. I may serve, Count Carving. 
but I take command from the guard captain. Right. Uh, speaking of which, where is he? He just ran off. Excuse me. Uh, seen any goblins around? Primitive little things, but damn if they won't swarm you. I've not actually, but I'd like to help you with your uh, your heirloom problem. I. Well, that. Oh, who am I kidding? Absolutely. This is driving me crazy. Just bring them back to me when you found them, and I'll be extremely appreciative. And I mean extremely appreciative. Seriously. I feel like offing myself right about now. Ooh, um, don't, don't do that. Do you have any suspects? Not in particular. Then again, the low lives of Bruma don't exactly hide themselves all that well. The shadier tavern in town, the restful watchman, full of thieves, bandits, thugs, and other miscreants, might be a decent place to start your search. Oh boy. Um... What exactly was stolen? Akaveri artifacts. I don't know anything more specific than that. Rignar and the Count both told me, but honestly it flew in one ear and out the other. Oh. If you want to know exactly what artifacts to keep your eyes peeled for, talk to Rignar. I'm sure he can help you more there. Alright, um... How did the thief even get inside the castle? I have no idea how they'd manage that, honestly. Either adept stealth or good luck. Probably a bit of both. I would have to. See you around. Yes, see you. I what will, um... Uh, respect so close. the oh. Lord. Always carry a good... I will get right on that. That was... Yeah, was a cold this time of year. more careful. And every time of year. Well, sure are talkative. I think I should, um... I think I should start with the tavern. I don't really want to bother Rignar right about now. Looks like things are, uh... Things are rather crowded in there. I don't really... do well with people. Might seem strange, a college man like myself. Not doing well with people. But frankly, that's exactly why I was in the college in the first place. Alright, now where was that tavern? Weary of the whispers, why not go somewhere more agreeable? Reside the resplendent boutique of magical wonders. Right then. He might be off his rocker a little. Skipping without her rope, as it were. Alright. Um How do you do? If I remember correctly, the last time I saw a carving. Was it Rignar that I saw in here? Let's find out, shall we? Because I saw somebody who looked noble heading in this direction. Ah, uh, that looks like not Rignar. Oh, that's Carvain. Greetings. Greetings. Um, I actually found one of your books. No, wrong Carvain. Um, sorry. Farewell. Uh, <laughs> well, I'm... Ooh, I... Good morning, I've been on the road for too long. Well, maybe not. Maybe I need to be on the road longer. <laughs> Alright, let's go see what we can find out. In the tavern. If I can remember which way it was. I have a feeling... It was down in this direction? Somewhere? Right, there's the, there's the smelter. I remember... Although my sense of direction is probably off because I was... Just running around trying to find anywhere, really. So there's the blacksmithy. Which means I have come in completely the wrong direction. There's the Synod Conclave. As the Fighters Guild. The Inn? No, maybe. Right, so that means it was down here somewhere. Zombies tend to haunt caves. Be careful if you decide to go treasure hunt. Alright then. Um, oh! Uh. Potions, Are lady. Are you looking for my husband, Ralgar? He's probably out hunting or something. I'm... I'm not... Actually... <laughs> right. Uh, I'll deal with that later. 
Okay, the restful watchman. Here we are. Okay. Deal with the smell. I don't know what that... I don't know what that smell is. I don't really want to know, really. Please, sir. The Just restful one watchman. Septim. Rooms and food, that's what we do. Um, what do you need? Have you actually heard anything about stolen Arkaviri heirlooms? I don't tend to gossip about my patrons. Bad for business, you know. Especially when you're in my line of work. Just tell me, I don't really want legal complications here. Piss off, you little bullnetch. Oh. The guard captain's tried to get me before, but he's never managed it for long. He can go suck on a spittle stick for all I care, as can you. You don't get far in this business by obeying the law, now do you? Right. I bet gold will change your tune. Perhaps. A little gold always greases the wheels. I'll tell you what you want to know. There's this Breton guy who comes through here every now and again. Sleaziest guy I've ever seen. Except for me, of course. Got a reputation to maintain, you know? Name's Atien, Or something like that. Anyway, he mentioned something to do with Akaviri trinkets while we spoke. Mentioned wanting to sell them, or something. I guess he's your man. Oh boy. Where can I find him? Uh, I don't know. Listen, do you really think I'm going to tell you everything about my customers? That's a sure way to get run out of this business. Alright, don't play dumb with me, Bent, y'all. We both know you're smarter than that. And so am I. Not going to happen. Really? Alright. I'll be back. Go on. Try. <clears throat> Great. <laughs> hmm? Can I help you? No. Sorry, just... Good morning. Good morning. Can I help you? Um... Goodbye, Fred. Uh, failing a simple job like that. No way it was just a coincidence. It must have been... Oh, hello. What are you looking at? I was Speak. actually going to ask you about Etienne, but what exactly were you mumbling about? I... That's none of your... I suppose there's no harm in telling you now. Who knows? Maybe you'll be able to help. I'm a mercenary. Been one for years now, and I don't often fail a job. But this last time, I did fail, but not through any fault of my own. I'd been hired by some anonymous noble to clear out a cave full of bandits near Bruma. Offered some nice coin, too. My wife came with me. We were battle partners. Things were going well and until we were ambushed. Bandit reinforcements showed up out of nowhere, flanking us the way we came. They bound us and gagged us, left us disarmed and defeated. They left with my wife and left me to die. I managed to escape my captivity, but when I got back to the cave, they'd gone. All of them. Including my wife. I've been searching for her damn near a whole year now. No success. Oh. Well, I know how losing a... I'll help you. Praise Malakath. Once you turn up something solid, let me know. I'll be here. The best place to start is probably the castle. Ask the nobles, see if they know anything. Of course. Mm, of course. I know how that can be. You here to do business? No. I've got rooms, I've got food, and drinks, and a thousand elven ladies under my belt. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? You ever run into trouble given your tavern's reputation? Well, honestly, sometimes I do. I'm only saying this because I suspect you might be able to help me out. You see, there's this snooty Altmer that came through here a few days back. One of those haughty Alinor types. Newcomer to Bruma. Well, he came here not realizing that the Gerald view might have been more to his tastes. After he witnessed a few of our, oh, you know, morally gray activities and an exceptional display of promiscuity, well, he decided to leave. 
Now, in his outrage and disgust, he's planning to try and press charges against my tavern. If you could just talk him down, I'd appreciate it. Oh boy. And why exactly should I do this? Because I can pay you, and I'm just too charming to resist. Why wouldn't you help me? Too charming to resist? Really? Not my type. Bye. Sorry. But, if I do that, he might actually be willing to tell me about this Atien man. You're not the same Argonian I was talking to. That's good. Alright. Wild Guar chases everywhere. Nordic heritage, Nordic culture, Nordic metalwork. Alright, let's see if... The woman with the potions stand is a little less crowded now. Looks to be... maybe? Yes, Traveller? What do you need? Oh, uh, nothing. Farewell. I'm actually trying to squeeze past you here. How do you do? Um... Are you, um... Talk to you later. Right, um... Yes, dearie? Are you a collector of artifacts? By any chance? Oh, absolutely. I collect anything Nordic, whether it be a crafted artifact or a spoken story. Some may call it an odd hobby, but I'm proud to preserve my people's ancestry. Right, uh... Okay, wrong kind of artifacts. Um, good day to you then. Farewell. Yes. Alright, okay, I will deal with that later. Alright, now's my chance. Oh wait, actually... Hello. Can I help you? Excuse me, but have you ever heard of the champion of Cyrodiil? Of course, the champion aided Martin saving the world from Merun's Dagon. Yes, indeed. And my great, 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 great... Well, anyway, my very, very distant grandfather. He fought alongside the champion. He was at the Battle of Bruma. He was the captain of the guard, no less. How interesting. The champion is my inspiration. Second only to Captain Bird. You know, the distant relative. I have a very large collection of Champion of Cyrodiil artifacts. My pride and joy, and I always want to expand it. Perhaps one day you'll aid me in that pursuit, huh? But that day isn't today. I need to track down another artifact first. Anyway, thank you for your time, and sorry for approaching you so abruptly. Sometimes my passion for the Champion can carry me away. Sorry again. Oh, I almost forgot. If you're interested, come to my house. I have a fantastic Champion of Cyrodiil museum tour available. Innumerable Champion of Cyrodiil artifacts. Come, check it out when you can. Unless any of them are Akaviri, I'm not remotely interested. Well, I thought he'd know something, but apparently not. All right, let's go find Either Adius. Looking for all that. Why are you talking to me of all people? Um. Talk to you later. Sorry. Oh, there he is. A Damnable tavern. Damnable owner. How dare? What is it? I am. Um, I heard you had a problem with the restful watchman. It's a dingy squad filled with criminals, rats, and lice. I want its proprietor to land in hot water with our dear guard captain. He deserves it. No. Say. Would you help me with that? I might. Sure, why not? Excellent. As it so happens, I'm a mage by trade. I have access to many Dennis, magical items from my home of Alanor. Take this. It's a I'm very special memory people. gem. I have one active at all times, and this particular one recorded lonesome. everything that happened in the tavern that very night. Dangerous place oh right boy. Take it and let the guard captain yes, listen to Ma. it. Irrefutable Sorry, evidence. Ma. I'm sure All he'll right. see fit to take Apology action accepted. then. But I oh, of course. You out here again, will I? I'm thinking that might no. be the legal Good. pressure Let's that go we need now. to have. Stranger, have you seen my dad? Sorry, what? Good afternoon. Uh, no. Where did you see him last? Dad's a soldier in the Legion. He's always off with them, serving at some fort up in the mountains. Oh. He's in the Legion. 
that's what my mom told me. She told me that her dad was in the Legion too. Is it there because of the war in Skyrim? By any chance? Yeah. Grandpa told me it's a soldier's duty and that I should be proud of him. Where's your grandfather? Is he in town? At home, I think. We all live in the big house across from the wizards. What's his name? Celis Prelius. Mommy says it's a strong imperial name, but I like my name better. It means I have a strong heart. Mommy must like it better too, because she uses it even though it makes Grandpa mad. And where's... your mother? She works at the Duralview Inn. I don't think she likes it there, but she says she has to make ends meet. Whatever that means. Who's end? And why does he need meat in the first place? <laughs> right, I think I know who you're talking about, actually. See you. See you. I hope you f Hope all goes well. If he's in the Legion. I don't think he'll be coming home anytime soon. <laughs> 